Ladies and gentlemen, 1983 Academy Award nominee for Best Supporting Actress, Amy Irving, and Academy Award recipient, Richard Dreyfuss. Good evening. In the grand tradition of American screenwriting, I would like to offer an actor's rewrite. And I would like to say I love you and good night to my son Benjamin and my daughter Emily. Well, then I get to say good night to Max. Good night, Max. In the category of original screenplay, the nominees are for Big Gary Ross and Ann Spielberg, who demonstrated that boys will be boys even if they're 35 years old. For Bull Durham, Ron Shelton, who wrote about baseball and other games grown up to play. For A Fish Called Wanda, John Cleese, Charles Crichton, who turned a good number of things upside down, including John Cleese. For Rain Man, Ronald Bass and Barry Morrow, for their chronicle of newfound brotherly love. For Running on Empty, Naomi Foner, who wrote moving notes from the new underground. And the Oscar goes to... Ronald Bass and Barry Morrow for Rain. Thank you, Academy members, and thank you, United Artists and the Goober Peters Company. In particular, I'd like to thank Tony Thermopolis and Roger Birnbaum and Stan Brooks, and to Dustin and Tom and Barry and Mark, my heartfelt gratitude for, for making the movie and for breathing life into these characters and into this script, and to Gary Loder and Mark Tingloff and Mike Adler, and to Bev and Clay and Zoe, my love for your forbearance, and to Kim, and finally to Marna for her courage. I thank you so very much. I'm just going to say goodnight to Jennifer and Sasha and leave it at that. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Dennis Quaid and Academy Award nominee for her performance in Dangerous Liaisons, Ms. Michelle Pfeiffer. They paired us up because we went to different high schools together. I thought that worked great. I got it from Walter Matha. But the not. Nah, Rain Man was an original screenplay written directly for the screen, rewritten directly for the screen, and probably re-rewritten for the screen. The following five wonderful screenplays started life as something else. A book of letters, in one case, a serial written at the turn of the century for a newspaper. You might say that they were all pre-rewritten. For Best Screenplay, Best on Material, from another medium, the nominees are Frank Galati and Lawrence Kasdan for their screenplay of The Accidental Tourist, based on the Ann Tyler novel. Christopher Hampton, who adapted his own play, Les Liaisons Dangerous, into Dangerous Liaisons. Anna Hamilton Phelan, screenplay Anna Hamilton Phelan and Tab Murphy's story, whose screenplay Gorillas in the Mist was adapted from the story of Diane Fossey. Christine Edzard, who took Charles Dickens' storytelling tapestry and spread it across a film canvas in her screenplay Little Dorrit. Jean-Claude Carrière and Philip Kaufman, who based their screenplay for The Unbearable Lightness of Being on the novel by Milan Kundera. And the Oscar goes to...
Christopher Hampton for Dangerous Liaison. Well, this is great, but anyone would fly across the Atlantic to get a kiss from Michelle Pfeiffer. Uh, I want to thank uh, Norma Heyman and Hank Moonjean, uh, my fellow producers, for showing a beginner the ropes. Uh, I want to thank Norma for putting me in touch with Bernie Brillstein, Peter Chernin and Eileen Maisel, without whose courage I think the film wouldn't exist, and faith in it. Uh, and finally, I want to thank the two co-recipients of this, uh, Chudlo de la Clo, who's having about as good a year as it's possible to have if you're a dead writer. And, and of course, Stephen Frears, who created the atmosphere for everyone to be able to do their, their best work. So thank you, Stephen. Thank you, Michelle, John and Glenn. Thank you, France. Thank you, America. Thank you.